Hey everyone, got a hot sauce for you here. Uh, Honeydew Tropic Hot Sauce. Uh, front of the bottle. Uh, angry looking lady with the rollers in her hair. And a, with a to do list over here. Uh, mow the lawn, paint the house, fix the swing set, wash my car. Alright. <laughs> Here we go. So. Nice secure packaging. Check it up a little bit. Let's see what we got. It smells kind of heavy, fresh. That real clean smell to it. Comes out thick. Not overly thick, but kind of chunky. I'm making a mess. Three, two, one. Mm. Wow, that's tangy. Habanero burn starting to pick up a little bit. I think it's a half burn. Uh, what we've got is ingredients, vinegar, mango, pineapple juice, raisins, oranges, red habanero peppers, natural sugar, salt, and xanthan gum. It's manufactured by the people at Sauce Crafters Incorporated, and they got a website, saucecrafters.com. So what's to say about this thing? Let's see. Well, now we know what you think of that weekend list. You get every Friday afternoon. But from our experience throwing darts, at it, mouth is worn. Won't get your won't get you very far. Make sure honey is happy so you do what you want for the rest of the weekend. I'm pretty sure he's gonna paint the house in a matter of a couple of hours you know. <laughs> be sure to pick up some honeydew sauces for the festivities that follow mm. tell you what I like this stuff it's neat got a pineapple thing kind of surprised me a little bit because I'm not a real huge pineapple fan. Uh, mango. Majority of it, I do like mangoes. Um, let's see, burn wise. <coughs> it's got a little bit of a building to it. Mm. I have a narrow build. It really kind of tastes like the ingredients. Mm. Not very vinegary, but definitely a flavor of mango, pineapples, raisins, oranges, red habanero peppers. Natural sugar, salt, and xanthan gum. I'm telling you. But I like this sauce. It doesn't have that traditional, you know, uh, Tabasco type of a hot sauce type of consistency. I don't think you'd use it in a similar type application, but I could see this definitely without being added like into a 
you know, a, a gravy or something like that, you know, or something that something where you want a hint of sweetness. Or you want some sweetness to it, but you want that citric sweetness, you know. Hmm. He was. It started in the back of the throat a little bit, moved around the mouth a little. Uh, about a four minute mark, and really nice warm feeling in the mouth. Um, it didn't uh, didn't really attack the lips or like deep down the throat. It's it's warm. I feel the warmth, you know, in my stomach. I can you know I feel it's warm, but. Uh, not an overly aggressive sauce, uh, tasty sauce, um, different, I wasn't really, didn't know what to expect the flavor of it to be like, but, um, I've always liked mangoes, and I, I thought, you know, any kind of sweet characteristic tends to go well with habaneros also, I found, but, um, there you have it, uh, we're at the, I don't know, about the, I forgot to start when I first did my first spoon. Um, a little, right around the five minute mark, might be a little bit past it, but uh, I'm decent sauce. I'm trying to think of what I would use it for. Maybe, maybe shrimp, and like making like a light sauce. You know, to go with shrimp or something like that. Uh, seafood type. Yeah, what's well, tropic hot sauce? Honeydew. I don't know where I got this from, <laughs> but uh. June found it. I'm sure you can get a hold of it at saucecrafters.com. Good sauce. May actually try some of this tonight. Anyway, I appreciate y'all watching the video. And uh, feel free to comment, subscribe, uh, and any of you that's ever tried this stuff or goes out and tries this stuff, uh, give me some feedback on what you think. And I guess I will catch up with y'all later.